Hi guys, Nick AK Folky, and in today's video I'm going to show you quickly how you can download and install Aptana Studio 3. Okay, obviously in Windows. Now, some of you probably have trouble downloading it from the Google and actually installing it if you manage to find the file in the first place. So I'm going to quickly show you how to do that. So in Google, when you type in download Aptana for Windows or something similar, or come up with something like this. Instead of downloading directly from their site, which is a load of crud, you go down to either File Hippo or Download CNET. Okay? Now, I prefer Download CNET as I've downloaded most of my software from here in the past. And it seems to be virus and malware free. So just click on Download. We'll let that download and I'll come back to you in a moment. Okay, once that's downloaded, it should have probably been downloaded to your Downloads folder or wherever you have your internet google chrome download section set to just go there and it will be there what we're going to do is we could drag it to the desktop so it's easier okay we'll leave it open for a minute now you want to do like a slow double click on the thing or just right click and go down to rename okay now you want to rename this aptana.exe hit enter once that's done, you want to navigate to your C drive. You should still have this window open if you didn't close it already. Okay, if not, just go there and then go to your C drive via the start menu. Okay, okay, C drive. And what we want to do is you want to drag it into the C drive, continue, and then it's there. Okay, then the next step is you need to go to your command prompt command prompt line so in here you just type in cmd and when this comes up you right click on it and run as administrator it'll come up with this lovely little window here all right okay now we need to type in the command that will allow it to bypass its its stupid installation you want to type in c colon forward slash aptana.exe space forward slash passive space forward slash no restart okay once you've done that put hit enter and it will start with a download And that's it. We'll close that down. And we'll open up Tyler up. Yeah, okay. And there you go. Installed and ready for you to use. Thanks for watching guys, if this helped you out, give it a nice big thumbs up for me and leave a comment down below. And sub if you really want to. Thanks for watching, I'll see you soon.